of this phenomenon. Ice cave. Nice place to spend the night. Probably two thirds of the way up to Greylock. And just put the snowshoes on. And this probably won't come out really well, but it's really sparkly here. And just just the last quarter mile or so it the ice on the trees showed up. So we're wearing the snowshoes because the snow's getting soft because it's nice and warm out relatively. And when it's soft, you can start sinking in, which is known as post holing. And you can actually see on the side of the trail somebody was doing that a few days ago. You post all it enough, it makes it really tough for other people trying to hike it later days. So. Ah, as you can tell, there's a lot of work. The snow is kind of sticky. But it does look pretty out here. and frosty oh by the way more winter hiking terms this middle of the trail is the, where everybody walks gets packed down pretty good it's called the monorail and this time of year it's not obvious why it has that name but when it starts to melt this is the last part that melts so this middle part is left looks just like a monorail Certainly a winter wonderland. It's pretty. I'm glad at the end of the day we get to drive back where none of this exists. Still winter. This is what this is what is called rime ice or hoar ice, I think I've heard it called too. It's really coated. That poor pine tree.
So, there's a parking area just below the summit. There's a little, I don't know, maybe quarter mile hike from there up to the top, which we're gonna do. But this is pretty spectacular. So they close the road to traffic in the winter time and gets taken over by snowmobiles. Oh, there's a cool picture. I don't know if you can catch the the uh, moon and we got a half moon up there. Anyway, this is where we're going to be heading in a second. Almost at the lodge. the lodge. Summit. There's the tower. So, somebody decided to highlight the tower. Oh, the way the wind was blowing. Pretty cool again with the moon behind it. No peepers this time of year. A little cabin. Nice little pond. You can see the melting is taking place down here. We're down just a little bit off the summit. <laughs> 